competitor Bernie Sanders has a lot riding on tonight. He has been the front runner in the polls in New Hampshire pretty much from the start. And after a disappointing, if narrow, loss in Iowa, he is hoping to give a victory speech tonight here in New Hampshire. WBZ's Christina Hager is live with the Sanders campaign at his headquarters right here in Manchester. Christina. Liam, if there is a victory speech from him tonight, this is where it will be at the Southern New Hampshire University Fieldhouse. This is where Bernie Sanders' campaign has set up for the night after he spent some of today meeting with voters. Even though the polls have Bernie Sanders poised as the candidate to beat in the Granite State. And now you what moved, if we did? And you moved here. I mean, what if we did? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you. He wasn't taking the momentum for granted. Meeting with voters in the last hours here. It's going to resonate here in New Hampshire, and I believe it's going to resonate all over this country. The people of the United States, finally, want a government that works for all of us, not just the 1%. He hopes high turnout at polls will bode well for his campaign. A lot of people are really motivated this year. Voters motivated by a desire for sweeping change. And I think that this Bernie's not electable is just a, a, a fear of change. We're going to beat Donald Trump because to defeat him, you're going to need the largest voter turnout in the history of this country. That's what you're going to need. So that is the question going forward. You know, Sanders himself has said that four years ago here in New Hampshire, his campaign set off a political revolution, and they'd like to see that through now. We'll be here watching with them in Manchester. Christina Hager, WBZ News.